Sunrise Time, 5 a.m. Good Tuesday morning. Thank you for joining us. I'm Dale Julian. And I'm Brittany Nielsen. Pope Francis making history as he touched down for the first time in the United States. He arrived at Andrews Air Force Base in Maryland yesterday. The president and first family there to greet him. He'll make stops in D.C., Philadelphia, and New York over the next six days. Our very own Dan Green is in Washington, D.C., where the Pope will canonize Father Junipero Serra just a few hours from now. Dan joins us live from Washington. The excitement is building. Hi, Dan. Brittany, the excitement is building, the security is building. This is going to be a very big day for Pope Francis here in Washington. Uh, much of the action for us will be focused on the canonization mass for Father Sarah. I want to show you, uh, again, the final preparations uh, being made yesterday, last night. Maybe you saw us. Uh, we were live out there as they were doing the final rehearsals. Those continued deep into the night and uh, into the morning. Again, last-minute security sweeps, but the final preparations are underway as they expect some 25,000 ticketed pilgrims to be on hand to attend that Mass. Much of it will be in Spanish. The actual canonization Mass will take place in Latin. Uh, meantime, security has been simply unprecedented here in Washington today. Uh, we will have extensive security at the canonization Mass as well, uh, where there will be um, metal detectors and TSA agents and much, much more. Very solid security presence there. It has not stopped the pilgrims from the Central Coast who have come to be a witness to history here in Washington. We got a chance to sit down and talk to them. They are thrilled. This, for them, a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. So excited to see the Pope. I mean, he's wonderful. Um, he's done so much and has such really good, positive thoughts that I think he's, gonna, he's really making a difference. I really feel that uh, Pope Francis being from a Latin nation, Argentina, and uh, Sarah also coming from Spain, they have that same gift of really trying to bring the gospel message to other people. But they they're both do it in a very humble way. And that uh, spirit of evangelization will be very much the theme today, not only at, uh, the, at, the, uh, at the Basilica of the National Shrine of the Immaculate Conception, where the canonization mass will take place today, but uh, also as he meets with bishops across the country, he'll do so at the, at the uh, Cathedral of the Apostle St. Matthew. That is where those pilgrims you may have just seen uh, went to Mass yesterday. Today the Pope will be at that church and he will meet with the bishops. Later this morning he will be meeting with the President of the United States. He will also take the Pope Mobile around the ellipse. It is a very busy day here in Washington for Pope Francis. Back to you, Brittany. All right, Dan, thank you. Live from our Hearst Washington newsroom this morning, we're going to check in with you again at the top of the next half hour.